Hey guys, I've been wanting to make a follow-up video um, from last week's video about what a write is. Um, and I made a couple of recordings yesterday and just they didn't come out right. So I'm going to try to make this as short as possible. I like to normally give explanations and examples, but I'm not going to do that today. I'll let you think up all the explanations and examples. Um, so my political opponents, the left, would say that if something is good, that there should that, that you have a right to it. Healthcare, education, you have a right to those things because they're good and everyone should have them. Um, and, and that's basically, I think, the, the left's stance is that if there is a good thing, we need the government to come in here and turn it into a right so that everyone can have it. That's the only fair way to go about things. Um, so obviously I disagree with that. Um, <laughs> but also a right allows you to do things that may be bad. Um, and I think that the, the left disagrees with that. They believe you have no right to do something that is bad. And that's why they would say that free speech isn't absolute. Um, you can't shout fire in a crowded theater. Well, actually you can, if there's a fire, you should shout fire in a crowded theater. If there's not a fire and you were just trying to hurt people, well, that's the end of your right because you you used your rights to hurt people and consequent there, there are consequences. Sorry, I'm giving examples. What I'm trying to say is that <clears throat> there are a lot of good things that you don't have a right to, good things that you should have, good things that you should pursue, and good things that people should try to allow other people to have and as much as they can. Those things aren't rights. They're just good things. Um, but also, your rights include the ability to do and say bad things. You shouldn't do that. You shouldn't use your rights to do evil. But you, you have rights up to a certain point. Um, and I think that a, a big part of why the left doesn't agree with me on this, that you don't have a right to do bad things. And everything that's good should be a right. The reason is because they don't believe that rights come from God. They believe that rights come from government. Um, and yeah, if the government is creating the rights, then yeah, we should turn every good thing into a right and every bad thing should be outlawed and you have no right to do it. But you don't get your rights from government. You get your rights from God. And the government is there to protect your God-given rights. Therefore, you don't have a right to every good thing. You have to use the rights that God has given you to choose the good things. And, uh, and you don't have to. You can use your rights to choose bad things instead. Um, so I think that that's one clarification that I'd like to make. And I really want to keep this video short because <laughs> my attempts yesterday did not. Too much explanation made it worse and worse. So I'm going to leave it at that. Go ahead and give me a comment if you feel like. Well, and let me put a disclaimer on that. If you do think that rights come from government, you can comment if you want to. It's a free country. It's free. You have free speech. But there will be no profitable discussion because you don't believe that there is a higher power that gives us our rights and expects us to use them responsibly. And if you don't believe that, then, yeah, we're at an impasse. And all we have to keep us speaking the same language is the law. And so I will continue to fight against rights that, you know, aren't actual rights, things that are just good and you want to give them to everyone, I will continue to fight against that because not everyone has to choose what's good. They should. They should choose what's good, but they don't have to. And rights are there. You're trying to force things on society when you try to broaden out rights into realms where you have to take from others. And, and I think that fundamentally that's not good. Obviously, we aren't angels, and so there has to be some government there, which means that we do have to take some of your money, but we need to shrink the government as much as we can so that it can keep everyone's rights safe and everyone can choose what to do with those rights. And, and whenever you violate someone else's rights, that's when the law steps in. And yeah, we should all pay for that, that government that steps in and protects our rights. And that can get expensive from time to time, but that that's where rights belong. That's where the government belongs. 
is to protect your God-given rights, not to enumerate as many rights as we can every time we find a good thing. So, all right, let me know what you think. Thanks for listening and have a wonderful day.